What is good, my reflections? What is good, my babies? Happy Halloween, baby. What a hollow day it is. October is motherfucking hours. And don't worry, reflection. It don't end here. November, we got that bitch in clutch, too. Baby, just shout out to the gods, baby. It's a great time to be alive in the motherfucking matrix. Are we or are we not? Are we assimilation? Are you a feeling that motherfucking agenda, baby? Okay? Because, you know, we. this is the money balancing it up. It's about transformation, baby. And you I already know uh, November we ain't slacking in that motherfucker neither baby okay October we putting in that work November we reflecting on our work do you hear me I say I say I say so today what are we here to talk about baby we are here to talk about one of my favorites my little shoe baby a shoe Zeus Satan the devil whoever the fuck you want to call him baby Jesus you get what I'm saying shit they said Teresa you put too much on me at one time I'm just keeping it real they call him a lot of names uh y'all cool you get what I'm saying they call him a lot of different shit different shit Judas. they call him a lot of different shit different shit but let's stay on track Today, I will refer to him a lot as Le Shoe. That's because that's what I call him, baby. I'm taking you back when, baby. Like, you know how they say if you was a fly on the wall, baby, I want a fly. I was right there, baby. Three, two, three, two, three, two, baby. Let me tell you what was going the fuck on. Okay, today we are here to talk about a time they had, because, you know, a show is really misunderstood. And people are like, first of all, let me talk like everybody here know who a show is. Baby, y'all don't know who Le Shoe, a show is, baby. Man, shit, you better get you a notepad and get up under that, get from under that rock around this motherfucker, baby, in the past, all the times, you know, that intuition you have, baby, you don't listen to it, and then that shit come out the words, baby, that's my, a uh, shoe, baby, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. see, a shoe is about duality, baby, a shoe, a shoe created a ego, baby, yes, a shoe, there was no ego before a shoe created that motherfucker, baby, okay, and he decided to step in that bitch when he created it, we said, a shoe, shit, if you wonder why shit get kind of reckless around this bitch sometimes, that can be a shoe, baby, oh, yeah, it's one or the other, they, you get what I'm saying, shit, okay, but today I am here to talk about a time they had my little shoe fucked up, baby. I'm here to talk about the time they kicked my baby out the motherfucking palace, baby. Just the fuck they did. Because, you know, a lot of people like to talk about all the bad shit the shoe do. You know how you had that baby, baby. That baby, do you get what I'm saying? They like to talk about all the fucked up shit that baby do. But they forget all the good shit the baby do. You get what I'm saying? They forget all the good, great shit that the baby made. They forget all the great inventions the baby did. They forget all the They forget all about this shit. They forget about them times. Because you forget, baby. The gods can't interfere with free will. You have choices. Now, you have a choice to go left or you have a choice to go right. You can go right or you can go left. You can go left or you can go right. It's a you whatever choice you want to make, baby. And that is all about what a shoe is. A shoe is about duality. A shoe is about choices. A shoe is about, you get what I'm saying. A shoe is the key holder. A shoe is that next step in, your, in the next cycle of life, the next phase. You get what I'm saying? But are you sure you're ready to go to that next phase? Because a shoe gonna test you and make sure. You get what I'm saying? A shoe loves you so motherfucking much, baby. A shoe ain't gonna graduate you until you're ready, baby. Okay. Let's go on ahead and let's get into it, though, baby. But one thing about a shoe, baby, he never lies. Mm-mm. A shoe never lies. See, a shoe creates illusions. A shoe likes to bend light. But bending light and creating illusions, that's not lying. That's just creating an illusion. <laughs> and that's just bending light. You, Whatever your mind perceives that to be, that's your what? Family? Free will. Okay, let's go on ahead and let's get into it, baby. Okay, so in order for me to tell the story, I got to tell you about Ogun, baby. Y'all like, who is Ogun? Shit, man, y'all don't know who Ogun is. Y'all out here with these switches and shit. Y'all don't know who Ogun is. Before it was a switch or anything, baby, it was Ogun, the baby, the god of metal the god of you get what i'm saying baby he created all our weapons and shit for us to get ready to go and battle around this motherfucker baby no, ogon wants shit to be fucked with now ogon you get what i'm saying ogon fell outside himself too why they be talking about the shoe and shit they forgot about ogon baby now i can tell this story i can tell this motherfucking story baby because you know yes yeah, saw who is yes yeah, saw oh y'all oh y'all is the um god goddess let me get this shit right and baby had shit this is a need another video to really talk about my yes oh, baby but oh y'all is the last breath you take oh y'all controls the breath that's in your chest right now baby oh y'all is you know when you hear thunder baby and then you hear that lightning around that motherfucker baby that's oh y'all up there baby oh y'all is the 
one over hurricanes, tornadoes, thunderstorms, yeah, yeah. You get what I'm saying? When it's a thunderstorm going, you better understand, oh, y'all is not happy around this motherfucker. Baby, yeah, baby. Shit, shout out to her. Okay. So anyway, oh, y'all is a force not to be fucked with. Oh, y'all is the sign of Scorpio. Oh, y'all is all about transformation around this motherfucker. Baby, baby. Okay. So now you can understand why the October and oh, y'all, Ashu and Shango all work together. They all, they walk the motherfucking together. You see that triangle around that motherfucker? It's Shango, oh, y'all, and you got Shu in the motherfucking back, baby. Okay, now, Shango and a Shu, they can sometimes, you'll get what I'm saying. They butt heads around that motherfucker. But, yeah, you know, when you're a lot of likes, sometimes you can butt heads around that motherfucker, baby. But that's story for another day. Let's get back on the shoe. Okay, so anyway, Ogon, you get what I'm saying? Ogon was the god of um metal, the god of, you get what I'm saying? He was real good with his motherfucking hands, baby. If I can say so, my motherfucking self, baby. Okay, his colors are green and yellow, baby. Yes, those are his colors, baby. Yes, he created oh, a uh, machete. It, like I said, he created everything. Like, how would how would even, how would you be able to, to clear the pathways? You get what I'm saying? You couldn't even get through a shoe. You got to have Ogun to clear, to get that machete to clear the pathway so you can get to the next, uh, get the next chapter of it. So Ogun is very important. Don't, let's not over, let's not, you hear what I'm saying? Don't get that shit twisted around there, baby. Okay? So anyway, but he still stepped out his motherfucking self, baby. Because one day, mm-hmm, let me take you back when, Ogun couldn't control his root chakra, baby. That's that sexual energy, baby. Ogun couldn't control that motherfucker, baby. And he done reincarnated back to this motherfucker. And between me and you, that motherfucker still trying to uh, control that root chakra. It's still a struggle for that motherfucker today. Okay? Fuck that shit. I can talk about it. I, it, it. I'm not one on the outside looking in. I'm sitting on the couch, baby, trying to tell you what it was. Okay? So let's go ahead and let's get into it. So anyway, Ogun, baby, he, um... He he was in the palace one day doing some shit. He ain't had no motherfucking business with his root motherfucking chakra, baby. You get what I'm saying? With with our mother, fuck you talking about? Yes, we. It's, if I, you get what I'm saying, I want to make the video too long and complicate the new people here, baby. For everybody who's not familiar with y'all, Arisha, baby, I don't know where you been, but you need to go study them, baby. But anyway, Ogun was in there doing some shit. He ain't had no motherfucking business with our mother. Fuck you talking about his mother on top of that shit. And anyways, Ashu sent it, okay? Now, Ogun knew Ashu sent it. Ashu didn't tell nobody at first, baby. He didn't tell nobody. But keep in mind, Oya know Ashu like the back of her motherfucking hand. And I, she knew something was off with his ass. She knew because he wasn't acting right around him. He wasn't acting right. Because Ogun stopped feeding him. Ogun used to, you get what I'm saying, distribute the food to everybody and shit. So, he stopped feeding my motherfucking baby. Yeah, they didn't tell you about this. They don't tell you about all this shit. They just tell you when he strike you. They don't tell you about all the trials and tribulations that he went through. Remember, Ashu was the last one to even receive his power. I say everybody else received his shit. He was the last one. So you know what they say. First is last and last will always be motherfucking first. Shout out to him. Okay. I don't play that shit by my little shoe. Okay. So anyway, but we're still going to take out his creations. Clean off this planet. Okay. Anyway, let's get back on the story. Ooh. Message. So anyway, oh, go start feeding my baby and shit. And after he stopped feeding him, not only did he stop feeding him, he kicked my baby up out the motherfucking palace, baby. So my baby was out here just out your baby. Just out your baby. Do you hear me, baby? The youngest one to ever do it. Just out your baby. Shit, imagine how you would feel. You the guy, first of all, motherfucker, you the one out here doing some sneaky ass, snake ass shit. Oh, okay. yes, you was, baby. And now you gonna kick my baby, you gonna stop feeding him, then you gonna kick him out the motherfucking palace, baby, like he gonna survive out here. What the fuck is wrong with you? Okay, anyway, that's why I cut his motherfucking ass. Y'all thought it was just because I left his ass for Shango and shit. No, 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 no. We was beyond it, baby. It was beyond it. We was in that bitch striking for all type of shit. <laughs> and then back in the day, fuck this shit. But you know, I still fuck with him though. I'm just saying, it's right is right, it's wrong, it's wrong. We had to balance this shit out. You know, yes, I don't play this shit with anyone. Ah, let me get back oh, from zero to three thousand, back to five, and back to okay. Anyway, let me get back to the story. Okay. So anyway, a shoe, <laughs> a shoe just out here and shit, right? Just out here and shit. So, oh yeah, she ain't saying nothing, but she, you get what I'm saying? She's very psychic. She's very, she can touch them. That's where they got this shit from. You know, in the movies when a motherfucker touch your ass and they can just see shit. Just see what you see, what you know, and know what you see. You get what I'm saying, baby. Okay, so 
oh y'all already knew what the fuck was up around here you get what i'm saying but you know just like a scorpio they strategic with they shit they'll get quiet until they get ready to strike that ass okay and she already noticing what my little shoe where he ain't been around the palace i've been noticing some extra meds you know that scorpio be looking they don't be saying much but they be looking around this motherfucker baby okay so anyway one day shane go you know oh, oh yeah she 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 like she ain't no sign something ain't up around something is off with the shoe Something going on with the shoe. You need to go see what's going on with my shoe baby. So anyway, Shango, you get what I'm saying? He out one day, just out. Just you know Shango, he always out doing something around that motherfucker. Probably shit he ain't no motherfucking busy. But this is between me and you. But anyway, so anyways, he run up on a, a shoe. Okay, so he like shit, you been kinda awkward lately. What's what's been going on with you, shoe? Like what's what's you can talk to me, you know, a shoe. He never lied. A shoe never lie. Keep in mind, what they say, a closed mouth don't get fed. Ain't nobody ever, didn't want nobody asking the shoe what was going on around that motherfucker. They knew something was off, but when nobody asking shit. You get what I'm saying? But Shay goes like, fuck that shit. Let's take it down. What the fuck is going on with you? A shoe. Okay, so a shoe told Shango what the fuck. Oh, go on then. You already know my Shango was ready to move. But you got to be, we can't go against cars and cars around this motherfucker. We can't, even though, oh, you sliced his ass up nine times, he didn't die because you can't go against cars and cars. Okay? So anyway, make a long story short, baby. Shango ready to get on his motherfucking ass, baby. You know Shango the God of war, baby. The God thumped around this bitch, baby. The God of I strike your ass down and don't think about it twice around this bitch. Baby, don't give a fuck if it's sister, brother, mother, lover. Okay? Shit. Okay? See? I'm just trying to tell you what you're fucking with, okay? But they all brothers and shit. So, anyway, Shango here, a uh, uh, shoe just like he told him what's the fuck going on. Shango like, man, don't worry about this motherfucker shit. Sure, it's in a motherfucking can around here. But you get what I'm saying? Because he already know. He ain't got to ask a shoe the shit twice. Because everybody already know. A shoe may be a trickster. A shoe may be light. A shoe may do this. A shoe may fuck up some shit around here. A shoe may put your water, throw some coconut, then some mud up in that bitch. But he ain't going to say he didn't do it. You get what I'm saying, baby? He bends light. He create illusions. But what do a shoe not motherfucking do? He don't lie. That's like somebody trying to come and tell you something about your baby, and you know your baby. You're like, hold on, then. You may say my baby done toe up some shit or did that shit, but I don't know. I know my baby didn't do that right there. Mm-mm. My baby didn't lie in there. They'll tell you they took that shit up. You hear what I'm saying, baby? My baby didn't do that right there. Okay? So we ain't even have to double it back and wonder a question. Was a shoe telling the motherfucking truth? Because keep in mind, we already knew something was up. Oh, y'all already had C and peep and game. Now, hold the fuck up, man. What these extra berry? Do you get what I'm saying over here? Fuck. What, what, what's going on? And my shoe ain't been around this bitch because I, yeah, you get what I'm saying? Who fucking playing with me, yo, girl? What the fuck you got going on in this bitch? So, anyway, Shane go ready to fuck him up right now, baby. Shane go ready to fuck him up. But, okay. Keep in mind, Shango got to keep quiet. Shango, he ain't got to keep quiet because Shango, I, you get what I'm saying. He kept it on low for a second. He kept it on low for a second. But Shango didn't never understand how, see, our mother was very powerful. If you don't know about Yemi, y'all baby, Yemoja, Yemaya, whoever you want to call her this lifetime baby, you get what I'm saying. She goes by many names. Mother Water, Muddy Waters, Mother Water, who, whoever you want, Mama Water, whoever you want to call her, baby. She go by so many names, she will tell her shit. How, how many, how, that's why I be telling people how you gonna correct somebody else about her name you have no idea how many names she even go by babe i can guarantee you that they not in a book okay so anyway fuck then some of them can't even pronounce on this uh plane right here so anyway let's keep this shit going i just had to correct that for the ones in the back baby okay so anyway I'm trying to keep it up because I don't want to make the video too long, baby. But shit, when we talk about the gods, baby, we shit, we could be here lifetimes, baby. Because I just have so many stories to tell you. Okay, so anyways, next thing you know, baby, the father of all fathers, baby, our father came in there, baby, and shit. He like, a shoe told him what the fuck was going on around that motherfucker, a baby. Okay? And when I tell you, you see, you heard Shango kept it on the low skin right there because Shango didn't even know. You get what I'm saying? He didn't understand why our mother didn't just destroy Ogun in the first motherfucking place. Baby. But you get what I'm saying? It's cosmic law. Everything happens for a reason. This shit plays out right down here. You know plenty of motherfuckers that can't control their sexual energy. Baby. Okay? Still on, in that root motherfucker shop. Gotta come out that bitch, baby. Okay? So anyways, 
make a long story short, shit, when our father heard about that motherfucking shit, be the father of all fathers, the father of the Orisha, baby, shout out to him, okay, he came in that motherfucker, and uh, that's when Ogun got banished, that's how Ogun ended up going to the forest, Ogun is not allowed in that motherfucking palace, he better not step his foot on that mother, don't touch that motherfucking, don't stop, baby, that gold, that gold, don't step up, put your motherfucking foot on that step, baby, you're too, I'm gonna chop that bitch off in nine pieces, Ooh, okay, anyway, back to, <laughs> back to the story baby shit so he got that's how he got banished that's how ogon ended up getting banished to the forest that's what a lot of people don't talk about they just know his ass is in the motherfucking forest baby oh you wouldn't even go to that mother they had to send a tune to that bitch they want to visit his ass baby oh you should step out there and night and again but just to check on him and his well-being oh you want to send that shit okay motherfucker well, cut me up now <laughs> but anyway so a lot of people don't see like they be like okay Zeus or Shu was Satan, Yakub, the devil. The devil is not real. He's not real. He's not in no horns. He looks just like what I just put on this fucking picture. That's one of his avatars. But anyway, the point is, baby, shit. They don't talk about all the trials and the tribulations that he went to. What makes you think the gods would even make him worthy to even put you through some tests if he hadn't went through no tests is what I'm saying around this motherfucker baby. But they don't like to talk about those stories. They don't like to talk about those t- trials and tribulations. They don't like to talk about all the times that he was out outside the palace not getting fed the motherfucking shit around there. He hadn't did a bitch at his time, baby. Because he sent you stepping outside your motherfucking self, baby. That's why Ogon, yes, was... He is in the forest. You can find him in the forest, baby. He was banished to the forest to make our weapons to the end of motherfucking time, baby. Yes, he was. He better be glad. Our father of all fathers didn't motherfucking. Yeah! Yes, because Shango was going to take his ass up out of here, baby. And Oya was going to clean it up, baby. That's why Oya and him, the marriage wasn't going to never work no way. People think it was just about Shango. That shit wasn't going to never work. You, that's a Scorpio. A Scorpio may listen. She, she didn't even want to marry Ogun to keep this shit being. But, you know. Can't go against cosmic laws. So, <laughs> anyway, make a long story short, she, but she fucks with him. Don't get that shit twisted. She do fuck with him. She do, yeah, get what I'm saying. But she don't, yeah, get what I'm saying. She can't forget that. Scorpio can't forget that shit. Shit, they still gonna have it always in the back of their head. With you cross that line, you gotta stay there, baby. Okay? So, I had to come through, baby. And you know I had to balance it out. So, we got a couple of great key points in here you get what i'm saying because history repeats itself so when you look at people who can't control their root chakra when you look at people who can't control their sexual energies and different things of that and certain sexual crimes you get what i'm saying they may have a little splice of that ogun energy but don't get it twisted ogun we couldn't have weapon we could have weapons we couldn't have machetes we couldn't clear none of our pathways you know how hard it be is trying to clear a pathway with your motherfucking hands babe i know we got some pounds and shit like that but i'm just taking you back when baby the, uh, you get what i'm saying a lot of things that are down here on this plane right now keep in mind he's the god of metal he's the god you get what i'm saying so a lot of pathways couldn't even be clear if it wasn't for Ogon. Everything we could, it's not like, don't ever get it twisted like Ogon is not needed. You get what I'm saying? But he still did some fuck shit. Just like they say about a shoe. They like to put a whole lot of bad shit on a shoe. But what about the good shit about a sh- what a shoe did? You get what I'm saying? What about the shoe that, uh, what about the shit that a shoe had to endure? What about the shit that a shoe had to go through? What about the path that a shoe had to, a shoe had to even walk? You get what I'm saying, baby? Let's not forget that. So before, like I I tell people before you judge your demons do not forget they were once angels i say i say i say october is yours